Kjartan Almar takes children through a traditional folk song from his home country of Iceland. He's more than happy to give them a taste of the culture at the world's only Icelandic camp in Gimli, Manitoba. You know, being Icelandic, it's really special and unique because there are only like 300,000 Icelanders uh, in Iceland, you know, inhabitants. But since we're so few, it's, you feel it's very, really worth it to you know, spread the message. For 40 plus years, this Manitoba camp has been doing so, welcoming kids age 5 to 18 every summer to embrace their inner Viking. They sing the music, learn the language, and even cook up some Icelandic cuisine. So we actually attract a lot of people throughout Canada, um, starting to try and get attracted a little bit more in the U.S. Um, and you know what, we've had um, numerous people from Iceland come here. Um, some of our staff are from Iceland, which is really awesome. Like Kjartan, who has been an instructor for the last two years, he's close to 3,000 miles away from his home in Reykjavik, but for him it doesn't feel like it. Me and my family decided to come and uh, we just really fell in love with the place, you know, Gimli and, and Winnipeg around that area. I really like feel at home in this place and I uh, really want to, you know, help support this community here. The ring of the bell means it's time to switch classes. And these kids are excited no matter what is next. Learning Icelandic songs and learning the language, we don't usually do that every day, but I think it's kind of fun. I feel like when you come to Icelandic camp and you keep coming here, you're more like a family than just campmates and I feel like it's um, a very close-knit camp. A memorable experience for children and the knowledge of a new culture to boot. This year actually we have a lot of new kids, new faces, which is fantastic because they'll fall in love and they'll keep coming back. And learn a few new skills as well. Yeah, hey to Sonia. For Shaw TV's Go, yeah, hey to Kevin Hirschfield.